I am in front of a lift and staircase pressurization fan. Today we are going to discuss about our, uh, the operation of the lift pressurization fan and staircase pressurization fan. Uh, as you know, you know it is a critical life safety systems that is staircase and lift pressurization fan and these systems play a critical role in high rise buildings ensuring a safe escape route during a fire emergency. Uh, and you know in case of fire smoke is the biggest threat to occupants trying to escape that's why Dubai's fire code based on you can see NFPA 92 mandates pressurization system to keep staircase and lift shafts clear of smoke. So let's discuss about you know different parts of it. This is the lower from here the stair uh, air will be entered. Then uh, this is uh, the VCD volume control damper. It is integrating with our BMS systems. In the event of fire, it will be open. Now we can see this is in a closed condition. Okay, so when there is a fire, the VCD will be open, and this is the terminal box for electrical uh, connection. This is uh, uh, the DPS differential pressure switch, which connected across across the fan. You can see. So this is uh, the positive pressure, and you can see this is the negative pressure connected here. Okay, so it is time. Uh, it is here is the negative pressure okay so to monitor the fan status uh, uh, we will get to know when the fan will be switched on then this is the duct you can see the fresh air is uh, you know entering by from the lower lower then uh, this is uh, the fan this is the fresh air entering from the duct to our staircase okay so let's discuss how does it work sorry well, uh, first we'll discuss from the damper. How does it uh, uh, does it work and how it will be activated? As you know, uh, the staircase pressurization fan and lift pressurization fan receive a activation command from the BMS. Then motorized damper. You can see this is the motorized damper, open to allow air flow into the pressurization space. Now it is closed. When there is a command received from the BMS, which integrating with our you know DPS differential pressure switch. And according to NFT A92 and UI fire code standard, there should be staircase pressure should be 50 to 60 and lift staff pressure should be 30 to 50 Pascal. Okay, so when there is a fire, as you know, we recommend we advise to follow the staircase instead of elevator. That's why there is a chance, you know, for the suffocation inside the uh, staircase uh, as well as inside uh, the lift. That's why that's why okay when there is a fire the fan should be activated and the damper should be opened and it will uh, 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 supply the pressure to our staircase and it is also you know integrated with fire alarm bms systems the systems remains activate until the fire alarm is reset okay so uh, also status feedback on of fault pressure level is sent to the fire alarm and bms for the monitoring okay uh, mostly uh, uh, at uh, you know you can say this system ensure clear evacuation routes and prevent smoke from entering escape area uh, well uh, then one most important thing also it's very important to know the sequence of operation for startup the staircase pressurization fan in front of us you know receives the activation command then the uh, motorized damper will open to allow air flow into the staircase when it will happen when there is a fire inside the building then the fire alarm panel will uh, send a command according to the command received from the panel it will be activated this is the grill connected with our staircase pressurization and duct 